so uh, my biggest focus right now is uh, developing the Neutron launch vehicle. Okay. Um, and it's been great to partner with NSDXL uh, through the Upstage Resiliency Enhancement Program, which has enabled us to essentially fund uh, a lot of the research and development with the uh, development of Neutron. But with the Upstage contract, we have gone to the point where we're actually developing hardware. Um, we've built carbon composite structures. Um, it's, it's on track to be one of the lightest ever upper stages in history uh, for a launch vehicle. So, um, yeah, it's it's um, going really well so far. Um, and then as we move towards the end of the period of performance, I think it's the end of this year, um, we'll have fully proven a uh, stage um, in its cryogenic performance, but also develop some systems uh, that make this upper stage in a very unique configuration possible. Um, but all this all to say that some of the teams are, um, are helping with uh, getting us on ramp for the NSSL program. So it's a key, key part of being able to engage with the government and, and uh, yeah, move forward. I think, I think the OTA is good. Uh, we appreciate the flexibility uh, that the government's also shown here with how we structure our milestones um, and the schedule flexibility we have as well to kind of get the work done in the most efficient way possible and then engage with the government and certification teams to, to get that milestone completed. So it's um, it's been good. I think we're really pleased with the flexibility. If anything, the OTA has enabled that. Um, we've been able to tune the scope, we've been able to adjust the scope of work in terms of what technical content has been discussed and presented and, and created as well. So, yeah, uh, all in all, a good mechanism for, for an for a R&D type you know, program where things change very often. And what you, you know, kind of set out to do at the beginning may not be uh, the end product, and the OTA's flexibility helps reflect that, while still making sure the value is still achieved. And I, think, I think on the launch side, our our biggest strength is that we execute, we actually do what we say we're going to do. Um, and that's been sort of the case with um, the Electron program. So we built a small launch vehicle right behind you. Um, and we've formed that about 35 times. And we've been able to use that technology and the same skill sets to apply that to a new launch vehicle um, that we're going through very quickly. Um, and yeah, I think that's, what, that's the unique proposition for us is that we are focused on execution.